I'm Lex Gopnik and this is the Lex Express and with the NHL playoffs in full swing, I'm gonna talk a little bit about your San Jose Sharks. Now I know a lot of the haters, the naysayers say, ah, oh, San Jose, they always have a great regular season, but then when it comes to the playoffs, they tend to turn into some bottom feeders and can't make it into the final round of the playoffs. Well, this year, things have changed. Since January 17th, the San Jose Sharks have been the best team in all of the National Hockey League, playing great on the road, playing great at home, getting performance and production from all four of their lines. Their defense has been solid, and a big change this year, the addition of goaltender Antti Niemi, who came over from the Chicago Blackhawks last year and actually almost single-handedly won the Blackhawks their first Stanley Cup in 49 years. Niemi's been great, but the man that makes this team go is big number 19, the captain Joe Thornton. I got a little expression for you here. We're gonna call it skill grit. He's the type of player that when he was drafted in Boston in 1996-1997, big guy, six foot four, the Boston Bruins and their organization wanted him to be a fighter and a banger and get into the corners and be a, a true power forward. What they didn't really understand or realize about Joe Thornton's game is that he's also a very, very skilled player with the puck. When he came over to the San Jose Sharks in that big blockbuster trade, the Sharks and their organization were able to understand that Joe Thornton is not the gritty, tough, fighting type of player. He's much more of a skilled player, and he was able to prove that his first year with the San Jose Sharks, where he led the NHL in points and was voted the league's most valuable player. In the offseason, Joe spent a lot of time working on his defensive side of the game, and it showed throughout the season. He ended the regular season with the most takeaways of any player in the NHL, and so far in this playoffs, his coach, Todd McClellan, has put him against the opposing team's top player, and he has shut them down throughout the entire playoffs. Obviously, the series against LA was a little bit tough for the Sharks. They didn't necessarily have their skates under them the way that they did, but now, in this series, going up against the mighty Detroit Red Wings, the San Jose Sharks are on the precipice of sweeping them and moving on to the Western Conference Final. With the skill grit game of Jumbo Joe Thornton and the entire performance of his teammates, watch for the San Jose Sharks to be raising that cup come June 2011. For the Lex Express, I'm Lex Gobnick reminding you that in sports just like life, don't hate the player, hate the game.